4.6a, Translate Percents and Applications, Translate and Solve. There are some key words that are used when you translate. These words are words such as what. When the question asks you what blank, that is where you would place an X in the equation because it is your unknown. If you see the word is, the word is in a sentence actually converts to the equals symbol in mathematics. The word of will convert to multiplication. And percent, just as it has done before, means divide or per 100, which means you need to divide the number by 100. It is helpful to have these memorized so that it is easier to solve the problems. Remembering that what is x, is becomes equals, of becomes multiply, and that percent is per 100. In example 1, it asks us what is 70% of 40. We can convert the sentence into a mathematical equation by using the key we developed above. The word what is our x. The word is, remember, is equals. 70% means that we have 70 per 100. Of means multiply and 40 is 40. After we have written the sentence, we can then proceed to solve it. It is usually helpful to start by dividing the percent to find its decimal form. We therefore would have x equals 0 0.70 times 40. We can now type this in our calculator to find that x equals 28. Therefore, 28 is 70% of 40. It is sometimes helpful to plug that back in and read the story to see if it makes sense. What I mean by this is to ask yourself, 28 is 70% of 40. If this sentence makes sense, then you have done the pro question properly. If it had a number that was larger than 40, we would then know that it could not have only been 70% of 40. Always a check to make sure that your answer makes sense. In example two, it asks 45% of what is 70? Remember once again that we changed this to a mathematical equation using the key we developed above. 45%, remember, means 45 over 100. Of means multiply. X is used for what? is becomes equals and 70. We now proceed to multiply, but first it may help be helpful once again to turn our fraction into a decimal. We then would have 0.45 times x equals 70. 0.45 times x becomes 0.45x equals 70. At this point, we then divide both sides by 0.45, just as we would do in a normal equation. 0.45 divided by 0.45 is 1, leaving us with x equals 155.55 repeated. Remember, we can write this as 155 0.5 with a bar to signify repeating, or we may need to round to a specific place. If it had rounded to the tenths, we therefore would have written the answer as 156, sorry, 155.6. Remember, when translating and solving, we must remember the key that what is x, is is equals, of is multiplication, and percent 
is per 100. It is also helpful to then change your percents into decimal form to help solve the problem more easily. Also, you should always make sure that your answer makes sense.